I feel like I did these type of videos quite a bit for MLB 20, but haven't really been doing them this year. What we're going to be doing today is working our way through, hopefully getting it done, but at least getting it most of the way done. The new 99 Legend Player Program for the 10th inning program, Jeff Bagwell. So comment section, two things. One, do you enjoy grindy videos like this? Because I just feel like a lot of people might not want to see this, but if they do, that's awesome, right? If there's a few people out there who are happy and enjoy this video, then I'm happy I made it. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're not already on the road to 100,000. Comment section, thoughts on this Jeff Bagwell card. For me, I'm going to try to keep it quick. Pretty much though, after seeing him, I just feel like he could have been better, right? At this point in the year, why not make the player program card? I understand it's not hard to get. It's a free card, but why not make the player program card at least able to compete? I don't want him to be on the same level as like Lou Gehrig, Frank Thomas, Babe Ruth, right? Like some of those guys but i still feel like a player program mid-december 10th inning program final program of the year before the forever one i feel like the player program should be a little bit better than this this is not a bad card i just think my expectations were a little bit high and for that reason i was a little bit let down but i'm curious to see what y'all think down in the comments section it's the same as any other player program you got some moments you can do an exchange if you want and then cap it off with one of these three so what we're doing no matter what in this video is the moments that's what i'm focusing on today is doing these moments grinding for this jeff bagwell seeing how we could get him and i really want to see your thoughts on him down in the comment section do you think it's a good card and do you agree or disagree with me that at this point in the year the player program reward should probably be a little bit better i don't want him to be on the same level as some of those amazing amazing guys but I feel like he could be a bit better. But like I said, my expectations, I think I might just have gotten him a little bit too high as well. But we're going to the moments, going to the player program. Jeff Bagwell, first one, hit one homer. One plate appearance, veteran difficulty. What I like to do for these is show y'all the first attempt, which did not go well. We chased a pitch. And then now what you're going to see next is the successful attempt. And I'll try to keep track of how many tries it took me, but... I'm probably just going to be watching Twitch or something while we go through it. Is that gone? Is that gone? That's gone. Yo, I did, I actually did not think we got it done. I thought it like bounced off the top of wa the wall or something. I don't know, but we got it done. I think that was my fourth attempt, maybe third. Now we just got to get one hit. This one's on all-star difficulty, but just get one base hit. It sounds easy enough. First attempt, we didn't get a dumb, man. That was a bad swing. Oh, there it is. We got a home run. So this is the final at bat of the first game. I didn't realize it wasn't just a one plate appearance thing. Uh, it's that first game that we got it in the final at bat. I think we were 0 for 3 at that point. On to the next moment, kind of flying through these. Hit one more homer. So we're hoping we can just recreate what we just did going back down to veteran difficulty. First attempt, not even close, man. Chasing that slider. And I feel like I'm kind of getting a feel for Jeff Bagwell. And I'm realizing why I never, ever use his cards in other versions of the show, man. I don't know what it is, but I just suck with this dude for some reason. And I, I feel like part of it's his stance. Like just staring at the top left of my screen. Or not even staring at it, but seeing that little wiggle waggle in the top left of my screen. Like for some reason, man. I feel like his stance just throws me off when I'm using him. Oh, I think that should be gone. This is attempt number five, maybe six. Hey, oh, that one was destroyed. Wow, okay. Man, if I could just hit a home run with Jeff Bagwell every time, I feel like I would actually like this card. I will probably try to use him in ranked seasons, definitely on that all-time Astros team build, which I need to start doing. Eight total bases, rookie difficulty, so pretty much let's try to get two homers or... I guess four doubles, but we got to start doing those all-time team builds, man, because I'm not going to do one every day, but even if we're only doing, like, two or three a week, it's going to go by fast. Like, I might not get him done before MLB 22 comes out. Oh, man. So, my first at-bat of the first attempt, we just popped out. Now we got a home run. If I could get one more of those, we got this moment done first try. Oh, gone. Yeah. Okay. Yo, Jeff Bagwell, man, I, I only have, I think, how many is it now? Five hits, and they're all homers with this card, so. I got, actually, we probably got some hits before on the hit one home run ones, now that I think about it. Uh, either way, though, he's hitting a lot of home runs. We got two moments to go. Hit a homer, and then tally four total bases, so. 
both of them on veteran difficulty we're gonna try our best and we're kind of flying through these man this is going a little bit faster than i thought first attempt we're chasing a pitch man that was just a bad swing i will say though back in i think mlb 15 diamond dynasty when i first started doing any type of twitch or youtube oh wait no we're still on the first attempt my bad but either way back in mlb 15 when i first started doing any twitch or youtube i got a legend they, there was one legend per team back then there was only 30 legends right and i'm pretty sure the way it worked was you collected a team's live series cards then you got that legend or something like that i'm pretty sure i feel like i feel like that's how it worked and uh the first legend that i got was jeff bagwell that year and i used him on my team i was so bad with him man. So we need four total bases but i was so bad with him like just terrible but he was my only legend that i had so i'm like okay i gotta keep using him right like i finally got a legend and it's a good card it's me that's the issue so i kept using him and using him and using him i never got better i, I think i kept him on my team the entire year but i i still never got better with him i think he was one of my worst haters out of everybody that i had on my team i thought that might be gone for a sec oh please get out yeah there we go honestly like i know what's on lower difficulties but he's been hitting home runs on swings that are not good. So if we use him in ranked seasons and he starts hitting these types of home runs, low key, we might got to keep him on the team, man. Because there's certain players, I swear, man, there's certain cards where their swing, even if you don't make a contact, is more likely to go for a home run than others. And it's just crazy to me. And maybe he's one of those dudes. So unless I'm stupid or miscounted or something, we got the moments done, right? We should have them done, I'm pretty sure. So we got that pack. Yeah, all the moments are done. And now I want to say we should be at 40 out of 50 in that player program. Also, hey, we only got one division left for Team Affinity. I want to try to get that done before Christmas, man. Before my Christmas pack opening. So I'm going to do my best. Maybe I'll have to do a showdown or something. But let's move the cam down here. Let's go to Jeff Bagwell. And we are, okay, 42. That, that's what I meant. I meant 42 out of 50. So got the moments done. Exchanges could get me to 47. But then it's like each mission, right? It's like, that's going to get me to 50. That's going to get me to 50. That's going to get me to 50. So we could either do five hits with first baseman online, three homers with Astros players in, wait. Yo, it, okay. So I, am I stupid? Like it says online, like y'all see that where it says home runs with H-O-U. It says online, three homers with Astro players, but then where it says where to play, rank seasons br events play versus cpu extra innings conquest like that's not online uh and then you can defeat the astros on all-star or higher in play versus cpu but what i'm gonna do is go put a whole bunch of astros on my team go into play versus cpu or extra innings hit a home run and see if that counts so i'll see y'all in a second hey there's one home run there's number two so we only need one more to go and we should have them now it's on the mission it says online but then where to play extra innings play versus cpu right like the offline modes are also part of it so i guess we'll see what happens i'm gonna just hit one more home run then back end of the game and hope that we see 99 jeff bagwell popping up oh might be yeah yo your don crushed that man off the dinosaur probably over the dinosaur that does not happen too often here in the jungle but we got our three home runs so now's the moment of truth man fingers crossed please let's see jeff bagwell popping up i hope it actually did count i really do come on please yeah there it is okay so it actually counted so that's weird that it says online i'm sure that's that's obviously just like a, a miss print mistype visual error or something like whatever you want to say but we got 99 jeff bagwell we have him ready to go for when we get that all-time Astros team going. I want to see if I made progress on the team affinity. Okay, now that's still 86%. Okay. So player programs, Jeff Bagwell completed. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, I had a good time doing it. I just hope you guys enjoy watching it. That's the thing. Like, my gut was telling me, like, hey, this video, like, people aren't going to enjoy it. But hopefully at least one person out there did enjoy it i just didn't have enough time to do like a ranked seasons game or something like that today so i hope you all understand hopefully we got more gameplay coming tomorrow it's just kind of a toss up here and there with the holidays and everything man just a little bit busy and all that but like comment subscribe social media is all that good stuff thank you so much for watching i do hope you did enjoy the video and i will see you next time thank you so much for watching i hope you have a fantastic rest of your day